In addition to the consumption charge, there is a demand charge. Demand is amount of electricity consumed over a period of time. The consumption charge for 10 kilowatt hours consumed over a 24-hour period would be the same as 240 kilowatt hours consumed in one hour. The demand in the second case, however, is 24 times higher, and for that reason the electric company would impose an additional demand charge. By trying to avoid operating large pieces of electricity-consuming equipment simultaneously, the maximum demand can be kept down. A utility typically looks at 15-minute periods throughout a billing cycle. The demand charge per kilowatt hour is based on the maximum demand period in the cycle, and that charge is applied to all kilowatt hours consumed in the billing cycle. The practice of basing the demand charge on the maximum demand period in a cycle is called a ratcheted peak. Depending on the power contract, the ratcheted peak rate may be applied for several months beyond the time it actually occurred. Finally, there may be a power factor surcharge on the bill. If the power factor of your facility is significantly lower than 1.0, the reactive power that represents requires an increase in the capacity of the supply system. The utility will impose the charge based on the value of the power factor. The total bill is based on consumption, demand, and power factor. Consumption and demand are the primary controllable costs, but all three of these areas affect the electric bill 